the absolute value of 2x minus 5 plus 8 greater than 13. I want to first get the absolute value part by itself, so I'm going to subtract 8 from both sides. So I have the absolute value of 2x minus 5 is greater than 5. Now what I, what I can do next is to split this up so that I would have negative 5 is greater than 2x minus 5, which is greater than positive 5. But let's take a look. Can I have a number, some x here, that would be less than negative 5 and greater than 5? Well, one number won't work, so I need to split this up so that it's actually negative 5 is greater than 2x minus 5, or 2x minus 5 is greater than 5. Now I can solve these two inequalities separately. Over here on the left, I can add 5 to both sides. So I would have 0 is greater than 2x, and dividing both sides by 2, I find that 0 is greater than x. Or I can add 5 to both sides to give me 2x is greater than 10, and then divide both sides by 2 to give me x is greater than 5. Graphing these, I'm going to have an open dot at 0, and since x in this case is less than 0, I'm going to shade to the left. And at 5, I'm also going to have an open dot, because it's not inclusive and then x is greater than 5, so I'm going to shade to the right. Writing this in interval notation then, would go from negative infinity to 0, with a parentheses, because it's non inclusive union 5, again the parentheses, comma, to infinity.